with it, horrible bastard. And he sends us, Gerard Butler, never forget him, fucking sends us all to jail. And by then, all this strike was over, straight to Brixton. Now, trust me, mate, you don't want fucking 30 Everton on a wing in Brixton. It was fucking on top to fuck, mate, proper on top. It was fucking evil. So they had to put us on a segregation fucking unit. I'll never forget, mate, on the Sunday, one of the scariest I've been in my life, this lad said to us, listen, if you want to, when you get half an hour out of the cell a day, go for your meals, take your meals back to your cell, all for our own protection. And then he said to us, on a Sunday, put your name down for church. He said, it's a fucking hour walk through the church and then everybody joins you. From, you can't stop no one going to church. Half an hour in church, hour back, Sunday dinner. Kills a fucking morning. Like, fucking hell, we do that, like. Fucking hell, mate. I've never seen anything like it. It was the fucking scariest day of my life, mate. They had to let all the IRA there. There was loads of IRA in, at the time in Brixton. It was just not long after when an helicopter tried to land and fucking break people out. It was all that time. And these IRA, fucking all sorts of fucking paedophiles and that in the church. It was going off over the fucking... Pews, the aisles, fucking the vicar, whatever his name, fucking pack it in. Come on, lads, a place. Like, you'd fucking hear that. So, ah, someone else, like, fucking hell. I never forget the week after the fellow church, everyone went, fuck off, we're not going back there again. Mm -hmm. It was fucking scary, mate. And that was a bad, bad, evil place. Then we did the rest of the.